All right, this is Absolute Wisdom, episode four. Four, right? Bill. What? We're doing a podcast. Okay. I didn't tell Bill that we're doing a podcast, but we're doing one. Yeah, you did. All right, I might have told him a few minutes ago. Bill, come in here. What? Come in here. I don't want this to be a long one because it takes a long time to compress. So, few of you have told me that the bill should not be killed off. So, he's actually still on the podcast. Why? So, alright, but the bill doesn't really know what's going on. I'm going to interview him. Because that's what all my podcasts are going to be now. Interview people. Because it was fun interviewing Brendan. So, the bill is a biomedical engineering major at Johns Hopkins University here in Baltimore, Maryland. So what is, what is BME? Um, no, what is it? Biomedical engineer. Okay. So like, biomedical engineer, like is are there any like job opportunities for that? Cause like, you know, you can study to be like a doctor or a lawyer or a pilot or like a filmmaker or something. But like, does anybody walk down the street and you're like, hey, what do you do? Oh, I'm a biomedical engineer. Well, that's, that's good. Um, so what exactly do you do in your, like, curriculum? Not very much. A lot of sleeping. Hmm. So is it hard? It's pretty tough. Is there any long division involved? In sleeping? As, no, in your coursework. Occasional. And are integrals? What's that? It's not. So, like, your exams, right? Yeah. Is it, this is for people who might be considering being a biomedical engineering major. Why would someone consider it? I, I don't know. Because it's the most popular major on campus, actually. Um, so, like, the exams, they mostly multiple choice or, like, essay questions. They're yes or no, actually. Yes, sir? Yeah. <laughs> wow. So your chances are pretty good. Um, like, and how late can you turn in something and still get credit for it? We'll see. <laughs> we'll see. Um, okay. Do you have to take a language? No. I have to take Spanish for film. How'd that work out? I, I took care of it first semester, freshman year, actually. It's all done. So... Yeah, why are you graduating early? Because I don't feel like being here anymore. Okay, right. So where are you going to be next semester? Here. <laughs> Does it make any sense? Yeah, well my education hasn't been based on making sense. Okay. Since you're stealing my lines, <laughs> I'm just gonna have you do a reading from the blog. Should we do the good Ted one? Okay. Let's get that out of the way. Which good Ted one? Sure, I'm trying to find it. I don't really prepare for this at all. Let's, let's start back in March. <laughs> yeah, so that's where we did all my work. I'm serious though, uh, which good Ted one? The one that we always talk about. The one that we know and we don't have to look up? <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's keep looking it up. Because after all, you wanted this to be a short one. Yeah. I need to like sing or something. Pass. Oh wait. You, you can, yes, this is it. You can still sing. Okay. No, his... Well, no, there's issues with that. Um, Alright, why don't you read that? The one that I've highlighted right there. And you need to introduce it. Oh yeah, this is um, from my May 2003 Thoughts Archive, and Ted is speaking first. Yeah, I'm not going to read yours because you're not very interesting. Right. Nothing is going to get it time. S. Beautiful. Why don't you read the one above it? This is also... Uh, we're on the same page, 
And uh, Ted is speaking first. I'm the other person. Well, go everything working now. Go? Extra word for your enjoyment. Yeah. Let's see if there's anything else in here. I don't want that one from Blake, so I'm not going to read that one. And there's one from you. It's not very good. Uh, no. It's uh, probably enough. Oh, God, there's got to be one more. I don't want to spoil them. I normally expect three good ones each time. After all, this is definitely not going to die out after one or two more. <laughs> okay, this one's good. You reading your blog is probably and... <laughs> Oh, this is from September 2003 on my thoughts page. And I'm, I'm speaking first, uh, John Young is speaking second. Remember Steven Seagal? Yeah, the weirdo? Yeah, his name just popped into my head. Go to bed. I don't know if he was in the news recently or what, but that was odd. No, no, he hasn't been in the news recently. You were just crazy. Yeah. Okay, now I feel like reading something from my, um, from my old blog. Do you feel this, like reading something? Well, you... I feel like having you read something. This is really getting longer than I thought this podcast yeah, was going to be. We yeah. should, all right, I here, have let's just go to quotes. The grill right now. Let's go to quotes and do one random. I could be eating. My rice is burning. Sorry. See, now Kelly's going to make fun of me for it, but it's going to be your fault. None of these are very good. No, they aren't. Come on. Keep that in mind. No one reads his blog. It's not very good. Um, I, right. I, this is just random. I, I'm, I can't even <sighs> tell. I can't tell at a glance what it is because it's Blake and it's like you have to kind of decode it. And you expect me to be able yeah. to figure this so out? So this is all Blake speaking. Or typing. Sorry, my quote sucked. Maybe you can spice it up. Or here's another idea. For two messages, I will not write in my shorthand starring now. So this feels really, really weird. It's annoying to type like that. That. Ah, uh, that feels better. Peace out, G. Alright. So that was from. Uh... November 21st, 2003, I'm and go vlog. All right. <clears throat> and to keep this as short as possible, I'm going to end it right now. Thanks for listening to episode four of Absolute Wisdom.